Photoshop guy I've ever seen in my entire life. I like how every Palutena in New York is like, has their own like color. <laughs> oh, really? Like, the, the color yeah, they identify Gen, with? Yeah, is like uh, the, red, the red one, I think. So he identifies with black. One? Got it. Like his soul. Wow. Hey, hey. hey. Are you wrong? No. Fro Frozen is white Palutena for his fallen brother Mewtwo. Aw, he can still use Mewtwo, which is still good. Ish. I <laughs> Frozen actually, actually hasn't touched Ray yet. And wait, no. Yeah, no, okay, yeah. I got confused as to who they were. It's, it's kind of hard to tell because number one, they're not using the, um, the, because the tags are different. And number two, they're playing both really well. No, yeah, it's, so not, it's all good. Frozen is the 3.02 one. The white one. Wow, oh, he just danced on them. that was on him. clean. Actually, knowing that Frozen was going to spot that, so actually just pivot grabbing once that happened. Yo, I got explosive flame too. <laughs> Literally. All right, Tolson. Good option to air dodge. You know, people people do keep on forgetting that that is a very real thing. You can use it. You can use a directional air dodge to hit snap the ledge. Oh, oh come on. my! You know that almost worked. He held it for that so long, worked. man. Wow. Nah, dog, you can't teleport through this. All right, what we got? Good idea. It's barely missed. Yeah, you're not gonna. Yeah, he. Oh wow, he knew. He was so early on that. Right, Yo, now. man, this guy is moving. Yeah, sure. Hoping Ray. Oh, beautiful twist of fate by Frozen. He needs to take advantage of the fact that Ray is a kill percent right now and off stage. Beautiful back air, and we're going to set to set number two. Uh, stock number two. <laughs> yeah, man. We still got some time for that, but here goes a combo. No nares. Okay. Good pivot guy, but unfortunately not able to start anything from it. Nair's not gonna kill just yet, but one or two more, one or two more probably will. All right, they're both playing so well around each other. All right, got the first parry of the set. Right, how far can Frozen take this? As he uses all that race to put Rain in a disadvantageous position. Oh, that was nice so catch. catch. That was so smart. And you know the thing is, I think that that actually would have uh, would have worked on Ray. The, the up smash charge. Yeah. Hey, pivot grab is not gonna work here. Your Frozen likes going for a lot of these tomahawk grab situations, from what I've seen. All right, there we go. Okay, and it's at 150. And I mean, this is this is pretty much all it's needed. And Ooh. it is. Frozen with the nice comeback, and you gotta um, you gotta think how's Ray feeling right now. You know, literally start off with the zero to one hundred in terms of his upper set, lead, and he did allow you know, Frozen to bring it back. Mm. Mentally, that can definitely damage him. Both players seeming mad, focused right now. Definitely avoids the, the uh, explosive flame ledge trap situation. No, we reverse it. What we got? Very smart by Actually, using Nair to cover it, whichever option they did. Oh, here we go. Ooh, Ooh the, the back here almost hit. Wow, man, that last hit in there, combo into the back air. Move is so good. All right, now we're noticing uh, the low, low recovery is happening right now. Ray understanding that he's getting punished because he's uh, using forward as a try and recover and immediately just gets back stage control. Now Frozen's the one that's at least advantage. Wow, so even anyone could win this game right now. Nice teleport Ooh. to get away. Oh, oh no! He was thinking that about moving action. forward. Wow. Yo, he was thinking about moving forward, but he been pulled back at the last yeah, second no, just yeah, as the I, I plane saw. came out. He, he actually, yeah, he, he could have definitely lived that. Man. Well, he could have definitely avoided that and then you know, lived. That was very even. I, I did not know he was going to win at all. Like, Except for that very beginning where it's like someone was just destroying the other guy. But then everything just evened out in the end. They're, yeah, no, they're, and, that, and that goes to show you, like, these players know each other so well. And they know each other's play style, so they're, all, they're just easily able to adapt. You know? Yeah, 
the only the main thing I see difference wise in terms of the play style is Utopian I mean, that's Utopian Ray, but Frozen loves to go for these grab scenarios, like where he's tricking you, he likes to get in your head and get for go for these situations. At the end of the game, uh it got in and got in the Utopian Ray's head when he was trying to get back on the stage because he wasn't worried about the grab. Yeah, no, I definitely, I definitely hear you on that one. As Ray just gets hit two mm. backers in a row. No! Oh my god. No, that was just scary. Go. I was so scared, man. I was like, I'm playing or something. Once again, Tomahawks by Frozen hard racking up damage. Oh! <laughs> that was close. See if that was in a roll for sure. Up there. Interesting. And is that her most damaging throw? Oh, wow. Oh, Beautiful catch by Ray. Oh, had you di and wrong, buddy. I'm... I you know, I'm surprised. Maybe it's just a, a, a against a Palatina thing, but I haven't really seen any drop down nares yet. Oh, it's, well, I saw that. Um, yeah. I mean, her teleport can definitely be punished by drop down nair, but I think that both of these players are smart enough to know that they can maintain stage control. If they can maintain stage control, it'll be a lot better than going going for the drop down nair. The risk reward is definitely, without, you know, the risk reward um, is definitely in their favor. Like if you drop down nair, they can see that and kind of like teleport back on the stage. And, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Sure. Uh, so you kind of want to do it. I'm assuming you're gonna do it like when it's like, okay, this nair's gonna kill. You know? Yeah, I got you. Uh oh, there goes the nair. Oh, beautiful auto reticle to actually stop. It's so close action. too. I know, right? <laughs> uh oh, double jump expended. Wow, barely missed. And notice how these players, these players are playing it right now. Very, very good spacing. None of oh! Wow, that was nice. That's the that's the frozen right there. <laughs> Try to do the same thing, mess it up, and get punished for it. Grab? No, too slow. Good dash attack. Oh, I Ooh. definitely would have nared right there. Oh, he missed the grab, but gets the parry. Nothing out of it though. And the thing is, like, when Palatina jumps, you, know, you, you kind of got to be careful because she does have her fast forward and she does have her back here. Oh. All right. Uh -oh. The two frame. Ooh. Barely missed. The Utopian Ray did dodge for the first two frames. That's there what we I'm go. talking about. The now we're there. using yeah. it. Um, I'm actually surprised they didn't kill him. I, I, it must have been stale as all hell because... Oh man, you can't land like that because the dash tech's coming, man. Punish? There we go. Okay. Yeah, too close for that. He got away with it earlier in the stock, but no no moss here. And we're back we're back to square one basically. Yeah, it's still very much even. Utopian Ray is not on the board in terms of wins, but he, this is his chance right now. Nice parry. Doesn't get anything out of it. Frozen backs off very smartly. They're just kind of trying to back at each other right now. Punish. There we go. And it's so hard because they know each other's spacing, too. Oh. You could have gotten more for that, man. Literally the exact same percentage. It's crazy, man. Explosive. Good F yeah. <laughs> oh! That, wow, that, that, was, so no, that spacing was so good. Because Frozen, Frozen knew that Ray wasn't going to come once he commit so hard, so he knew that he was actually safe by, by throwing out the S. Oh, dang. Because he wouldn't get punished for it. Very even game right now, but it just seems like Utopian Ray just has the, the ground options covered. Oh! Reading out the jump, Frozen's going to take it too well, guys. That came out so fast. I wasn't even. No, yeah. yeah, yeah. Unreactable, man. You don't want to get your jump read by a Palatine. That was very nice, that, yeah. That, that just hurts. That just hurts. Right. Say, Austin. The funny thing is he had the advantage oh, on the ground, man. but just made one mistake and got grabbed. This Jump? is Sparta! <laughs> <laughs> Yo. <laughs> just get to what you like, ah! in, in that situation, you saw that even um, he got scared into using his double jump, which led him right into the back here, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see, so I mean, Frozen, you know, 
tournament nerves definitely aren't a thing. Uh, but these two, these two guys, these two guys are veterans. So I think it was just, uh, mm -hmm. I think it was just an honest mistake, you know.